chanting, music, and signs were just some of the ways people joined together at the Boston climate strike. Thousands of kids and adults from across the state have come together to make their voices heard, including ninth graders Martin Armstrong and Oliver Coops, who skipped school to come here. At this point, we don't really have a future. Yeah, the only, the only time to change the future is now, and you know I think that we should be trying our best to do that. There's going to be irreversible consequences very, very soon. If the global temperature rises by 1.5 degrees, devastating effects will occur. Sixth grader Cam Feruzbach, who should have been in class, spoke about the changes we need to see from large companies. It will pressure them to agree with us and understand that... Um, Especially for the, the oil companies and um, gasoline companies, they need to know that our generation matters. Scientists say there are just 11 years left to reverse the climate change. Students aren't taking any chances. They want to make sure their voices are being heard. Just want to have a future. Because like the people are saying that we only have 11 years left and 11 years I'll only be 24, which is not an age that you should be worrying about not having a future at all.